Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Dawn and Dyra here, back at you again, doing another video for you tonight. And today I'm doing this particular video because I had several people um, reach out to me and ask me about autoresponders. So I thought that this would be a good um, topic to make a video on. So you know how I do, I just get right into it. But before we get started, I will like to say thank you to anyone who's new to my channel. I appreciate you. Anybody who's been with me from day one, I also appreciate you for stopping by, um, getting great value from me and any information that I have to share with you. I'm glad that you have stopped by. Thank you very much, appreciate it, okay? Doing a diary here. <laughs> So where I want to start is we, we're going to talk about order responders today. I think I've done a video on it some time ago. I'm not quite sure how deep I got with it, but tonight I'm just going to show anyone who doesn't know that where you put your first name in your email, sometimes there'll be a phone number there. This these two boxes here is what you call an autoresponder. And this page here is what is called in the industry a landing page or a capture page. It's called a capture page because you're capturing the name and the email of a person who's coming through your sales funnel. When it's a landing page, for me, it usually doesn't have these two boxes. It'll just have the button there for you to click on and then you'll go through the system and maybe after you click on the button is when you'll see the um, autoresponder for your name and your email to go through. So the thing with autoresponders is you shouldn't be afraid of it or you know think it's something that is scary it's not scary it's the most helpful thing out there this is how you build your lists this is how you start growing your business this is like the lifeline of your business so autoresponders are a blessing and everyone should have one now what i'm going to share with you is that you can have a third party autoresponder. You want to have one outside of the um, business opportunity that you may be with because all business opportunities do not, um, how can I say, they do not have a system where you can have leads coming into the system and you can email them at the same time. Yes, your leads will come into through that system of the business opportunity, but it's going to be your responsibility to make a list, excuse me, make an email campaign so you can send out a campaign to your list. Now, before I get too far ahead of myself, usually with a business opportunity, there'll be the generic campaign page that they go through. And usually that business or that program or that system, they have their own campaign within the system. And they will be sending periodic um, emails to your leads, maybe for seven days, 30 days or whatever. Then there are some um, systems that it's going to be your responsibility to get your own autoresponder, like you see here, and put in your own email series within that autoresponder. And when the people um, come into your autoresponder, the leads that you get, they'll be coming through your funnel, not from the company's funnel, if that makes sense. Because eventually you're gonna to wanna to send out your own broadcast that comes strictly from you, from your thought process that you wanna send out to your um, list. So I'm gonna share with you Aweber. Aweber is a third party autoresponder and I'm going to move up so we can see Aweber in the window. Yes, Aweber is a third-party um, email autoresponder. 
And as you can see here, it says I have 142 subscribers that have came through um, my Pure Profit Pro list. And the reason why this number is so small, it may not be small to everybody, but it's small to me because this particular autoresponder is connected to the generic page, the generic capture page that is provided through Pure Profit Pro. Now we're going to go over to the conversion pros. Okay. <laughs> I be getting ahead of myself. Before we before we do that, I just want you to see that within Aweber you have something called a legacy follow-up series. That is where your uh email campaigns from your system that like say I'm in easy cash code. I'll just Okay, I'm with Easy Cash Code <laughs> and um, and Pure Profit Pro, and in both systems they have um, email campaigns that you can put within Aweber. So I'm going to click on this legal follow-up series, and as you can see here, all of these are email campaigns that will go out to my list automatically and I had to have a share code to put into for it to go into a Weber um, <clears throat> I'm not going to show that in this particular video in this particular video I'm just basically showing you what an autoresponder is and how it works so whenever you get those 30-day emails for anybody that's an easy cash code. You want to come to Legacy Follow Up Series, and there is a video within Easy Cash Code in the back office that you can go to that will show you step by step how to um, get those emails um, in there properly and go out to your um, list in the right way. So, with all that being said, let's go to the conversion pros. Now the conversion pros is a marketing tool where you can have landing pages, email um, autoresponders, so much. I've done several videos on the conversion pros, but right now let's focus on the email broadcaster. Okay, so now with the conversion pros, you can have as many as many lists any as many campaigns as you like and as many autoresponders as you like and as you can see here I have three autoresponders here one for easy cash code the conversion pros and pure profit pro and as you can see here in pure profit pro I have over 400 um, contacts in pure profit pro and the reason is because I basically promote my um, my Pure Profit Pro website more than I do with um, Aweber because Aweber there is a fee once you get 500 over 500 um, subscribers the price goes up so I use Aweber but I don't use it that often I use it to send out my email broadcasts okay to that list you know and there I still get people coming through um, that generic um, website that I get for pure profit pro and I also built another uh, list for easy cash code within Aweber also before I forget so as I was saying now with, with the confer the conversion pros I have over 400 people within the conversion pros and in the conversion pros, just like in Aweber, you can send out an email series. You click on the email series, and these are all of the emails that go out to a person when they first sign up under me 
these are the emails that were given to me through um, my sponsor through a share code and you have to go in you have to tweak it and all of that so having a autoresponder is key you want to have it it's a wonderful thing to have it's your business it's like the lifeline of your business the conversion pros also these are email broadcasts that I have sent out myself that I've written myself and they go out to people whenever I send out um, these email broadcasts. So I've written them myself and I've sent them out, you know, to my list. Having um, an email series and an email broadcast, they're two different things. The email series is what is the email that a person will get when they first go through your funnel. You haven't typed up anything. As soon as they go through your funnel, whatever your system or your company emails, whatever they've given to you, the email series is what the people will get. When you send out your own emails, it's going to go through something that's called email, email broadcast, excuse me. And let's go back over here to AWeber. For me, when I send out an email broadcast with AWeber, I go to create a message and I click on this HTML editor. I'm not going to click on it because I don't want to um, write a message just yet. And then you would come to a blank page where you just start typing up your, um, your email. That's how it works in AWeber. AWeber is, uh, like I said, I like AWeber. Not everyone likes AWeber. Some people, there's something else called Get Response. There's a MailChimp. There's a lot of other autoresponders out there that you can choose from. I just chose to use AWeber because <clears throat> I used it once before back in the day, you know, when I really didn't understand what an autoresponder was truly, truly about. So I came back to AWeber because I understood the platform and I'm happy with AWeber. So I'm over 12 minutes and I like to think that you've gotten some real value from this um, video of me sharing how to use an autoresponder and what an autoresponder is and the difference between an email series and an email broadcast, okay? So this is Dawn and Dyra here back at you again. Love sharing value. Love just helping people out there in the industry um, do better for themselves and just letting you know that I'm an upstanding person. You come to me with a question. I'm here for you and I'm going to answer your questions. Anybody who is not a go-getter, not an action taker. They seem to be what they call like tire kickers or what have you. Uh, my time is very valuable. So I will um, entertain you for, you know, in the beginning. But if I see that you're just there to just basically waste my time, then I'm not going to interact with you anymore until I see that you are serious, okay? Didn't mean to disrespect anybody or hurt anyone's feelings, but it is what it is, all right? So this is Dawn and Dara here back at you again, sharing another video with you. I'd appreciate it if you're looking at this on YouTube, on YouTube, excuse me, to subscribe to my channel, on Facebook, um, just um, follow me on Facebook, and um, follow my Facebook fan page, okay? Or like my Facebook fan page, all right? So Dawn and Dyer, Dawn and Dyer here, back at you again. And I'm going to call it a night. You guys take care. Have a good one.